in here, seeing your faces, seeing your creativity, I know you are going far. You will go places. As we were coming this morning, I saw a school, and the name is Future Leaders Academy. I said, that is the norm, what we have been made to believe that the youth are future leaders. But they are not only future leaders, you are the present champions. Do you hear me? No person should tell you, oh, you are the future leader, you are going to enjoy it tomorrow. No, it's time now. You are the present champion. Is somebody understand what I'm saying? Without the youth, without the youth, most great event in the world are not there. Just read history. Go to the Bible, the contemporary history. The people that champion great events are youth. Are you are the next? person on the list. Amen. I said you are going to be the next person on the list. Amen. Your hand, Say, oh my word. Oh my word. I'm not only the future leader. I'm not only the future leader. I am going to be the present champion. I'm going to be the present champion. Because I have something to offer to my world. Because I have something to offer to my world. I am a solution provider. I am a solution provider. I am an innovator. I am I have, I have an idea. My world. My world. Give room. Give room. I'm coming. I'm coming. I am coming. I am coming. To change my world. To change my world. Do you believe what I've said? Yes. That's yes, what the world is waiting for. Is somebody hearing me? The world is waiting for you. A lot of people are complaining, pointing finger at the president, at this one, at this one. No, they are waiting for you. Look at the people that are changing the world. Yesterday, I read on the net the girl that won the science global science award is eight years. Eight years. What did she do? She discovered that her village, they have a lot of problems in terms of the cost of boiling water to drink. It was very cool in the Philippine area, the mountain. That they spend a lot of money. And most times people cannot afford it. So what she now decided to use waste. Through that trash, mentors, waste, and formulated something that can heat water through the solar system. Do you like that? Yeah. She has now become global. Her name is the Global Map. In fact, that is my topic this morning. How to put your name in the Global Map. Do you hear that? Yes. How many of you want to name in the Global Map? You want to make impact, global impact? You want to leave a good bridge that people will read and say, so so, so person live in the world. Hello? Listen to me. It's not by any how. It's not by any how. There are few things, few steps you must follow. What are the steps that can distinguish you? You know, she was just reading really about me now. Yeah, a, a global innovator for the United Nations Sustainable Development Goals. Uh, an innovator for the African Union in, on education. The, the, I am coordinator for Global Mentors International in Africa. On the list of Google as a digital innovator. A certified inventor by the Federal Government of Nigeria with a printed license. And many and many and many. You can do even beyond that. I said you can go higher than me. Amen. So how? What are the steps? What 
coincidence. Number one, you need to discover what you have by your own use. Which means you need to know who you are. Who are you? You are a bundle of talent. Listen to me as you are there. You are a bundle of talent that has never been explored. The plane you are carrying eh, is the greatest machine in the whole world. Your brain. Every day your brain generates over 3 million ideas. There are cells generating ideas every day. And most people, they have not discovered this brain. Because they have not discovered the power of their brain, they are non-entity. Or non-entities. You are not going to be a non-entity. Yeah. I say you are not going to be a non-entity. Yeah. There is a center in, your, in the human brain called the PFC. Write it down. PFC. Prefrontal cortex. The prefrontal cortex is the womb of idea. It's where invention, innovation comes from. Let me tell you, if you don't know it and you don't use it, you will ever remain an animal. That's what scientists, philosophers, psychologists, they have concluded, professors, that any boy, any girl, any man, any woman that have not discovered and use that portion of the brain will remain the level of an animal. So the first thing you need to do, if you must be great and put your name in the world map, is what? To discover the use of the PFC. First of all, you discover yourself. I say, first of all, you discover yourself. Number two, I'm just trying to summarize this morning. Number two thing you must do or you must know is to think global. Tell somebody, think global. Think global. Okay, it's a saying in blue that if you want to be a millionaire, you think like a... A millionaire. Huh? A millionaire. You think like a millionaire. So if you don't want to die as a local champion, huh? Somebody said, come for me, I'm going to die as a local champion. I can never die as a local champion. If you must not die as a local champion, you must do something. You must stay global. And that is why global is not the form of the airspeed, successful development goals of the United Nations. It's one proof for you. Don't go it. Don't now. 
Yes. Yes. What, you, what you will see will surprise you. That I am a household lady. Right now, in most of the countries I go, they don't even ask me to pay money for visa. Because of what is coming out from the brain. By the grace of God. By the grace of God. How many of you want to put your names in the global map? Another thing you must do, listen to me, is to find a need and solve it. And that is the name of this organization. So, so, every human need, I tell people, is a raw material. Every human problem you see is a raw material for somebody to work on and bring a solution. So when you are complaining about light, no light, uh, about uh, food, and the light is saying, use me. Yeah, this boy in Malawi, he was so poor, no education. When his, his maid are in school, he would go to the public library. You know what he was doing? He was talking about electricity, solar energy, and all that. And from nowhere, he invented how to generate electricity from the wind. From the wind, this free wind, that's it. And now it's now being straight up in that country. As we are talking right now, another young man too from one of the African countries. He was also concerned because the use of fuel, petrol, all these gases there, destroyed those whole layer about how human beings are dying. Right now, scientists are complaining, human is complaining that the amount of carbon dioxide that is going to the air, in fact, we are at the point of killing ourselves. If it continues like this in the next four or five years, it will be very difficult to exist on earth. Your, the, the night you sleep, the heat is so much. They are complaining. Blood is everywhere. It's because of the ozone layer. So this boy decided, what do I do? You know what he did? He went, looked inside himself, consulted his brain with the help of God, and came up with a new motto that runs on solar without charging. No, you don't charge it. The one in America, after running for some time, you stop, you charge it. But this boy from Africa created the one that runs on solar continuously. And as we are talking right now, they have paid me to America. They have given me a house. They have given me the best, the best university to study and expand that invention is now on the global map. It's okay to say what I'm telling you. Solve a need. Discover a need and solve it. That is it. That is it. Once you can solve a need, a problem, today there is the problem of plastic. It's a nuisance. Do you know what to do with plastic? Convert it to something that is useful for man? You are solving a need, and before you know it, you are out of this country. People are saying, oh, it's yahoo, yahoo, you must do for one night before you get. No, no, no. If you can solve a need, you are out. Tell somebody, discover a need. Discover a need. And solve it. For this, I ask you, what are some of the problems of the world? My, my friend, do you know some of the problems of the world? Who can tell me some of the problems of the world? Oh, your community. Huh? Oh, your community. In your environment where you are living. Yes, my friend. The problems. Yes. Huh? No quality education. No quality education. It's true. It's a big problem. So can you solve, can you bring a solution to solve that? Yes. Huh? Yes. Do you have a solution? Is there one person, any person that has a solution here to solve that? You have one? Okay, yeah. What is your solution? Yes, well, she is right. I spoke on that two days ago at the uh, Federal University of uh, Technology. Uh, and people were there, professors and other people. You see? We can have all the education. Do you know that the digital platform has made it easy? You can study anything at your home. I didn't study computer, I studied science technology in the area of pharmacology. But today I'm, I'm a digital guru because of what I study online. So 
we can you can have quality education even right from your house. Even the poorest among the poor can have education through the digital platform. You can take advantage. I know of a lady. Listen to me. She she is from Senegal. She was kidnapped when she was 14 years, according to her. She told me and she shared it for me. I take it to France. After many years, somehow, so she managed to escape. If we were to be some, some of you, you would say, ah, they have ruined my life. They have useless me to hide in the cooler. But she came out. She said, what would I do with my life? She went to the bookshop, bought books from coding to coding. Had to go, studied it, mastered it, and she said she's going to teach one million women and girls from coding. Sorry, we are going to close very soon. She said she's going to teach one million women and girls from coding. And she's, this Amina Nation is carrying her all over the world to go and train other young women. So that is part of the solution to quality education. Are you understanding? So solve search for a need and solve it. Any other problem of the world or your community? Insecurity. Insecurity. So can we have a solution for that? Yes. What is the solution? By bringing about and Yeah, and policemen. But I tell you again, the digital you can if you can design an app yes. eh, that can monitor an environment, the world is for celebration. You can think because when you can if you design an app that monitor what happens in America, police are not, you don't hardly see them. But they are seeing everything that is happening. Are you understanding? Any movement they know where you are, but you don't see them. If you drive anyhow, you park anyhow, before you know it, you just receive an alert. That social time you park wrongly, go and pay a social amount. If you like open, after six, three weeks, your motor will be seized. Without any person monitoring you. So these are problems. Then again, if you want to put your name in the global map and be wealthy, you must avoid distraction. Don't we say avoid distraction? Avoid distraction. What about distractions? Distractions, bad friends. Eh? Uh, drug abuse. <coughs> Smoking. Eh? At small age, you start a boyfriend and girlfriend. All those things, they are distractions. They are not destroying your life, your future. To avoid distraction, you must walk with God. You must seek the way to know God and walk with Him. Don't allow yourself to be distracted. What is it? I'm robbery. Kidnapping. These are distractions. They are destroying the, 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 the life of many young people. So you cannot allow yourself to be distracted. Are you understanding me? Yes. Then above all, you must have innovative ideas. Innovative what? Ideas. Albert Easton is a scientific wizard. And he said, it is madness for you to do a thing the same way every year and you are expecting a different result. So can you come out to tell the world that you can do something different? Can you come out with some different product? Different idea, different product. What is, you know, you see what is in my hand, huh? What is people think? The rich boys. This one is the monitor of my head. Every blood pressure, my blood sugar, the number of hours I walk, everything I press now, you just tell me. This is what the world is doing right now. Everything is talking around. You idea, you think.
That's why I ask you to respect it for you. Oh, okay. But that's a very uh, long lesson for that. You see, what, what song, the black thing, is song? Uh, rich, nutrient, water. Not even soil. So if you know how to put those environment, any crop can be planted and harvested without the soil. So that's what called soilless farming. Sorry, soilless farming. Now, finally, you must be on the digital platform. If you want to be global, you want to put your name on the global map, be on the digital platform. What do I mean? Create a blog and showcase what you are doing on the blog. I was discovered in all my life, I, have, I labored for many years, over 30 years, no better than you. Walking, the first book I wrote was 2000 and in the year 2000, Innovation for Human Survival. No person here. But some few years now, when I went digital, as you said, I have over 50 books on top of me on the digital platform. I have a blog, I have a Google channel. So when you are the digital platform, people can discover you. They know what you are doing, you can't hide. So you must learn computer, ICT, and learn how to be on the digital platform. Even from your house, from your home, you can walk, you can learn, you can walk and earn. Do you know that? Eh? You don't need to complain about money. You can earn money as you are learning, you are working, and you are earning. Many of you have a smartphone. All you need to do is uh, Facebook it. Leg booking, back booking, down booking. We see your time, we see your resources, we see your money, we see your data. You can earn money from that your smartphone. Hello? How many of you want to know that? How many of you want to know that? Okay, that's why I want to give you the final point. You must be mentor. You need mentorship. Are you hearing me? You need mentorship. So I have discussed with your madam, the auntie, please clap for her. But I put the team together that we are going to mentor you. Some of you, we are going to be digital writers. We are going to mentor some of you who can write. You will start any money from your writing, from your playing. We will help you publish it online. We will help you put your content on Google, on YouTube. Are you understanding me? And the team, the, the, the team that are working, they are here. It's the Buddha instructors, and all of them, they are here. They are going to help you. So you must keep in touch with this organization. Solve the name. Somebody say, solve the name. So we are going to mentor you on this various aspect on how to learn, how to work, and earn money. How to be digital, how to scale up your idea. And above all, any of you that, are come out, that can come up with unique ideas, we will recommend you to the United Nations. I'm in a, I'm in a happy for that. Can you clap for that? Yeah. If you come out with a unique idea on how to solve any of these problems, who will recommend you and they will pay, they will send passport, pay air ticket for you. Before you know it, you will land yourself in New York, they will put you in the best hotel. After the program, they give you something good. So, so say something good. Something good. And if your idea is scalable, they can just begin to scale the idea all over the world. And that is already, you are global, you are rich, you are influential. So you can become anything you want to be because the world is celebrating. The world has opened the door for you. Last week, the United Nations celebrated the United Nations uh, Youth Day International. They are celebrating the youth because they feel that the youth is very, you are, you are very important. Look at your neighbor and say, I am very important. I am not a minority. I am not an idiot. I am loaded. With things, with, with ideas. ideas, I am ready to change my world. I am ready to change my world.
my word, I am coming, I am coming with my idea, with my, ideas, with my solution, with my solution to, change things. to change things. My word, wait for me. Wait for me. Wait for me. Are you ready? Now? Are you ready yes. to change the world? Yes. And the world is saying, yes, you are welcome. Yes. Wow. Thank you so much. Thank you so much.